Hey guys, how are you doing? Hopefully you're having a great day. We are out here today with Aaron and Brian in his boat right there. Uh, we're going to be fishing kind of together, I guess you could say. Yeah. Here and then just over 35. Yeah, but mid 30 range. Beautiful. Beautiful fish. Oh. Yeah. Alright guys, look how steady this fish is. Look at that guys, he T-boned it. Now it's on the book. 39 on the dot. How is... How did this happen? I don't even know. I don't even know how this happened. I don't even know how this happened. I don't know how this happened. <laughs> well, change of plans, guys. He's right there. Yeah. He bit me like, I don't, on the way down, he bit me. I I didn't see him when I was coming up, though. I was coming up. And I dropped back down, and he was just there. And he just bit it on the way down. That's crazy. <laughs> uh, we'll, we'll play him back here. We'll play him back here. He's not that big. Now I have 60 feet of line to make up and count it. <laughs> you might want to loosen that drag. It's loose, dude. Is it? Yeah, it's not that big of a fish. He burped? No. Yeah, he burped. Did he? No. <laughs> My legs are shaking. <laughs> Well guys, this is part two of our pike day that, as you guys can see, has turned into a lake trout day. I'm going to talk about this fish catch later because I don't really know how it happened. Um, we've been lake trout fishing for the past probably half an hour or so with Brian, and um, this fish came out of nowhere and just smacked my bait. So we're going, to, we're going to work on bringing this fish back to the boat. He was at the boat, we saw him, probably about 10 pounds or so, um, but then he just went right back down to 60 feet. So. We're going to work on him. I do not want to lose him. Brian, I think, just noticed that I'm fighting one. He's coming over now. Can you hold your rod for the butt that you're for? No, because I'm going to lose the rod because I have no wrist power left right now. Look, that's him on the bottom right there. Yeah. 60 feet down. He is 60 feet down. We see him on the graph. Brian's coming to watch. <laughs> this is actually my first lake trout jigging, like, by myself. All the other times I've been with Brian. Yeah. Yeah. So this is pretty cool. I dropped my bait down and he was on it. He bit like. He bit it on the way down. Yeah, he bit on the way down. I looked at the fish finder. I was like, I think that's a lake trout. <laughs> You're like, yeah, that's a lake trout. You dropped down. I'm like, I think she has it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my wrist. <laughs> this is pretty neat. We went from. An almost 40, 40 uh, incher, and now we're going for some for some lake trout. Oh yeah, pretty little lake trout. Make sure you get the head first, eh? Yes. Oh, dude, my wrist. <laughs> <laughs> nice. That's probably what. Eight pounds? Eight pounds. Eight pounds or so, just under ten. Heck yeah. <laughs> That's a nice way to uh, change up our day. <laughs> there she is, guys. T-boned our bait that we have going on right here. There she is, guys. Under ten pounds for sure, but beautiful, beautiful fish. Let's uh, release her right here. Right away. 
Nice. Right away. Awesome. So, so this was all Brian's idea. Brian's a huge lake trout guy. You guys may have seen me jigging for a lake trout with him last summer. But we were having lunch in, our, in a pike spot and um, <laughs> Brian's like, let's go, let's go try for lake trout. So we're like, okay, let's go, let's go see, right? We only have one rod rigged up for the two of us right now. That's how um, uninvested we were. But <laughs> I don't know what happened. Let me show you guys on the screen, try to demonstrate what happened. But I was, I was jigging here and I brought my line up like to move kind of deal. And Aaron's sitting here looking at the graph. I'm standing back there and Aaron has Good eyesight, I have bad eyesight. I couldn't see too well. Aaron's like, drop your line, I think I see a lake trout. Right at the 20 foot mark right here. So I drop my line and I see the lake trout dart up a little bit. And I'm, I'm, I didn't think he actually took my bait. I think I thought my bait was still falling. But Aaron's like, I think, I think you have it. <laughs> so I reel up, set the hook and there was a lake trout. I didn't get the hook set on camera, but um, there we are for the first lake trout. As you guys can see, the the sun that we have been waiting for did show up um but i guess now we're going to be lake trout fishing for a little bit <laughs> So that is what we're driving around looking for. We are uh, fishing kind of a main lake point here and every time we see either a fish or a ball of bait fish we stop. In this case we actually don't have to spot lock because there's literally no wind and um, this is what I stopped at when I caught that last fish. Uh, and so this is just a bunch of bait fish. We actually, I actually hooked one by accident, just got a little scale, but all bait fish here and should be lake trout in the vicinity here. You know what guys, I just put two and two together. Water temp, 40 degrees, that's surface temp. It makes sense why that fish was in 20 feet in water, of water because the water's still cold. So it could, the fish, the lake trout could literally be anywhere in the water column. Uh, we're actually gonna try a little bit shallower um, right now just kind of get away from Brian <laughs> and we're gonna yeah we're gonna see how that goes try a couple more a couple of the shallow shallow shelves we have out here on the main lake and see if we can find some lake trout or some or some bait fish What's uh, that? ice cream and pike sure yeah I'm down <laughs> all right change of plans they're not really setting up are they yeah we don't know what they're what we're doing because the water's so cold and they're shallow. So we're gonna go get ice cream and we're going to go back to pike fishing to end off today. Eat it. Eat it. It's gonna see the boat soon. Don't move the trolling motor, eh? Dude, come on. He's following it down. Dude, no, oh, he's running away. He's running away. He's swimming right there. Dude, oh, that's 40 inches. Aaron, that's 40 inches. Aaron, there's 40 inches sitting on you. Aaron, there's 40 inches sitting on you. Aaron. Dude. 
Turn around here. Let me get the trolling motor. That was 40 inches sitting on you. That's huge. That was 40 inches sitting on you. <sighs> wow. The one that was following me was like average size that we catch here. The one that you caught was like a foot longer. Or the one that you, uh, was on you was like a foot longer. We're gonna loop around and then fish it face on. I'm going back to the glide bait. I'm going back to the glide bait. As soon as I sped it up, dude. As soon as I sped it up, they wanted faster than the morning. Yeah. Yeah, a lot faster. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Alright, guys. She is probably another 34. Yep. Almost 35. Almost 35. That's what he said. He should be ready to go. Kick off. Hey. All right, speed up, let's go. All right guys, one last stop of the day. This is where we saw the biggest fish of the day followed us in but wouldn't bite so we gave the spot a little bit of a break and we're back a couple casts here and then we're we're headed home all right so that's a wrap all right guys so that is a wrap 6 a.m to 6 p.m two parts to this video as you guys saw in the morning slash right before lunch it was kind of our hot our hot pike bite we got a bunch of pike um we caught them you know kind of on the slower side of fishing glide baits we had lunch we went for lake trip for a little bit i managed to hook one i don't know how <laughs> and uh, we ended off with a bunch of followers so we definitely saw my pb here uh that's for sure aaron almost almost got a 40 incher which is pretty cool but like i said we did end off the day a little slower with a bunch of followers but that being said we fished uh glide baits all day I will link the rod, reel, and line combo I used down below. Huge shout out to Aaron for coming along with me and Brian for coming along with us, I guess you could say. Had a really fun day and we will be back for redemptions. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video and I'll see you guys in the next one.